What a what a wonderful story. You know, it's it's a privilege to to get to know a little bit of the real fatherhood mm. of uh, some of the players and uh, the people involved in Courageous. Mm. You played a very different dad, Officer Shane Fuller. I did. Um, had visitation rights with his son. Yeah, it was. You know what? It was a really. It was an interesting role to play because, um, you know, Shane Fuller is a dad, uh, and he he strives to be a good dad, and so he is put into a position that he's got to make some difficult decisions, and. Uh, the outcome of those decisions, uh, he is given a lot of time to think about the consequences mm -hmm. of the decisions that he makes. And so it is, it's, it's really inspiring and encouraging to see the different journeys that these dads, all of these fathers in the movie Courageous go through uh, because you can relate to one of their journeys. Um, I can relate to one of the journeys of one of the dads uh, in the film Courageous. And so um, the movie is inspiring. It will it will bring you to tears. It will it will make you laugh. There there's no question about that. The authenticity too, I think, is so important mm -hmm. and meaningful. Um, again, I'm just trying to be careful not to say what I should say, but uh, because you have to see the movie and be surprised where you're supposed to be surprised. But the Kendricks haven't been afraid mm. to show committed Christians. Who are fallible? Hmm. Um, yeah, one of you the know thing, what I'm referring to. Uh, yeah, you know, one of the things I admire about the Kendricks is that they are bold for the gospel, and so uh, they wanted to create stories um, that uh, didn't always wrap up in a perfect bow. Exactly. And so, and you'll see that in Courageous. It's mm -hmm. like, you know, oh, this was nice, but this doesn't really happen to me. People aren't going to say that. They're going to say, you know what, I know this somebody. This is my neighborhood. Th this <laughs> is my neighborhood. That happened to me, or I know somebody that this happened to, and I can see how this could potentially change my life. Mm. What would you like to see in terms of my, the release of September 30th? Mm -hmm. I hope it's going to go overseas and mm. and everywhere most of the projects have gone into other languages and yeah I'm excited that it's releasing in Canada on September 30th the same day that it's releasing in the States because uh, I think that's a huge step for Christian filmmakers mm. um, and it's an opportunity for the Canadian audience to really make their voice heard because there's a lot of films in development and in production right now and we need to have them released in theaters the same time that it's released uh, in the States and so this is a wonderful opportunity for that to happen and I think um, in future films uh, this is our chance to really make our voice be heard by going out and buying a ticket on September 30th. Well, shall we give them a taste? Yes. There may be someone watching today who hasn't seen one of the trailers. We'll show you right now. Courageous. Sheriff's office. On the streets, they put their lives on the line. I know you see the worst side of people out there, but when you clock out, go home and love your family. But at home, they struggle to connect. Can I talk to you? I suggest that you spend a little more time with him. Do you really feel like it messed up your childhood not having a dad? More than you know. The creators of Fireproof. Resolution? Yeah. You've been a good enough father. I don't want to be a good enough father. Can I say this too? I feel like a rich man. I know that I want the very best for you. I promise to take care of you. Every father should step up. So where are you, men of courage? Courageous. Honor begins at all. This film is not yet rated. In theaters September 30th. Kevin Downs as uh, Officer Shane Fuller. A great community, a great um, band of brothers mm. we see. And uh, through some very tough things. That's, a, that's a, I think, something men long for, mm. someone they can share their heart and their journey with. And I'm hoping out of this movie that there will be those kind of groups of men who can come together and talk about their struggles mm -hmm. and support one another, pray for one another. That's right. That's right. Uh, you know, our law enforcement community does such a 
selfless and wonderful job in putting their lives on the line each and every day to serve and protect us. Mm -hmm. And so I think Courageous, uh, we wanted to get uh, accurately portray the sacrifice that those men and women go through every day. And um, uh, we've had the privilege of being able to screen it uh, for a few prior to the release. and. and and they, for officers, for for a few officers, not not uh -huh. very many, just as influencers, and uh, and we've had some come up in tears and just say thank you. I mean, mm. thank you for getting this bond of brotherhood and portraying it accurately, uh, because I think so many people don't understand what it is that we go through, and it brought me to tears when you hear their testimony. And so, um, I just man, I I have such a renewed passion uh, for law enforcement men that that serve for us. Wonderful. And the men in Courageous, like those real men, mm -hmm. uh, we, we get, I've said it before, it's appealing back as we go into the movie, we see what their real lives are all about, and it's not one that's perfect. No, we're all not, working on something. That's right. We're all working on something. Um, we don't have, uh, there's not one that's perfect, and I, I think that's what's so unique about Courageous, is that we'll relate to somebody's storyline in that film, men or women. and. Um, uh, it, it's, it's wonderful. I'm excited about it. The whole continent, at least, mm. is going to be experiencing this launch at the same time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's, almost, it's a dream come true. I mean, I remember uh, a good friend of mine that's also a Christian actor. We would uh, sit out in front of his house in the early 90s and just kind of dream about the day that, uh, that Christian films would have the launching pad uh, that they're getting today and so it's really is exciting and uh, we just praise God uh, for every step uh, that he's creating along this journey so will you go to the theater to see it absolutely <laughs> absolutely opening <laughs> night though you know every there. word you've still got to have the experience well, okay. yeah I'm gonna cast my vote absolutely oh, okay. yeah I'm gonna buy a ticket I, yes that's important uh, it's very important because so the when, attendance mm -hmm. opening night determines the duration in the theater. Yep, and it determines if more Christian films will come out in the theater. Will be made. So when Soul Surfer came out, I went and bought a ticket even though I'd seen it several times and mm. uh, same with Courageous, even though I'm in it and I've seen it, I'm going to be there buying a ticket with my entire family. So. Got to be part of the buzz too. Yeah, well, that's fun, but it's really it's really about uh, just seeing the ministry that that God is 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 now bringing and the fruit of that mm. ministry that's going to impact people. Forward. Yeah. God bless you and thank you. Thank you very much for having me. We'll be right back.